Rats sometimes become more of a problem around construction because their existing burrows are disrupted by the digging. They need to find a new place to live. Rats are attracted to accessible resources like food and water. They may also be drawn to a home's porch, deck, or shed because it's the path of least resistance to food, water, and shelter. When construction began nearby my home on Long Island, we started noticing holes along the decking of my bulkhead along the canal. My friends saw many rats going in and coming out. The first thing I did was call the exterminator. As time went on, I noticed more and more holes and even larger ones near the end of the decking, which was near my neighbor's decks. You may not have holes in your backyard ground, but the rats know how to go from yard to yard with just one entrance. I was shocked when I learned how bad and expensive a rat problem can be. I was shocked after learning their life cycle. Rats begin breeding as soon as five weeks of age and continue until about age two. Females are fertile approximately every three weeks, and during this time they have been known to mate up to 500 times in six hours. The resulting pregnancy usually lasts about three weeks and the litter size typically ranges from six to 20 babies and then those babies will start breeding at around five weeks and the cycle continues. Hear this again. Once rats reach sexual maturity, they will start cycling through litters every four to eight weeks, producing between six to 12 babies in each litter. The full-term gestation period is roughly 21 days with only one to two days necessary to recover and breed before becoming pregnant with the next litter. Two rats can easily become 15,000 rats in one year. Did you hear that? So this is no joke. Two rats can easily become 15,000 rats in one year. Did you hear that? So this is no joke.